and it is Pirate Lass coming under pressure, picked off by Drummond Warrior, trying to challenge his Blue Raven, the No Purple Rain. These are followed by Caesar's Comet, and the outside has approached the city with Double Martini as they head for the furlong pole, and it is Drummond Warrior challenging latest Caesar's Comet on the outside in the green cap, and into the last 100 yards, it's Caesar's Comet, and Shane Foley getting the better of Drummond Warrior. It will be judges call for the third. And it is Pirate Lass coming under pressure, picked off by Drummond Warrior, trying to challenge his Blue Raven, the No Purple Rain. These are followed by Caesar's Comet, and the outside has approached the city with Double Martini as they head for the furlong pole. And it is Drummond Warrior challenging latest Caesar's Comet on the outside in the green cap. And into the last 100 yards, it's Caesar's Comet and Shane Foley getting the better of Drummond Warrior. It will be judges call for the third. They're chased up by Two Wake, who's a couple of lengths to find. Then Pride of Derry and these four have gone clear. Racing to the final furlong, and it's Mount Fairweather in front. In second place, and running on is Two Wake on the outside of Wellsworth. And then comes Pride of Derry, racing up to the finish. And Two Wake on the near side has pounced in the final 50 yards. As yet another two-year-old winner for Colin Keane and Jer Lines. Two Wake beat Mount Fairweather, Wellsworth and Pride of Derry. They're chased up by Two Wake, who's a couple of lengths to find. Then Pride of Derry and these four have gone clear. Racing to the final furlong, and it's Mount Fairweather in front. In second place, and running on is Two Wake on the outside of Wellsworth. And then comes Pride of Derry, racing up to the finish. And Two Wake on the near side has pounced in the final 50 yards. As yet another two-year-old winner for Colin Keane and Ger Lines. Two Wake beat Mount Fairweather, Wellsworth and Pride of Derry. Hard press, Golden Lyric with the nose band, and Rosa Woodsy trying to get on terms. Sola Luna next, then Al Kabila, and Give Her a Squeeze is trying to stay on. But the leader is friendly, racing to the final furlong, and has quickly gone clear from Golden Lyric, then Give Her a Squeeze, Rosa Woodsy, Sola Luna, and Al Kabila. It's friendly, and Wayne Lorden on Easy Street here, winning by going away four lengths. Give Her a Squeeze second, Golden Lyric in third. Hard press, Golden Lyric with the nose band, then Rosa Woodsy trying to get on terms. Sola Luna next, then Al Kabila, and Give Her a Squeeze is trying to stay on. But the leader is friendly, racing to the final furlong, and has quickly gone clear from Golden Lyric, then Give Her a Squeeze, Rosa Woodsy, Sola Luna, and Al Kabila. It's friendly, and Wayne Lorden on Easy Street here, winning by going away four lengths. Give Her a Squeeze second, Golden Lyric in third. As they begin to straighten up off the turn, Red Heel from the Dillon, Spill Passion now gets reminders, staying on as Flying Rock, out wide as Windsor Pass, then Crystal Dawn, Q Palace, Sweet Justice, Rita Levy, Joe March, take my hand, Maha Seal, but skipping clear is Red Heel inside the final furlong from the Dillon, Q Palace, Crystal Dawn, and they're followed then by Flying Rock, but it's Red Heel and Lee Roach who will see it out by a comfortable couple of lengths. And second is De Dillon, then Q Palace, Crystal Dawn. As they begin to straighten up off the turn, Red Heel from De Dillon, Spill Passion now gets reminders, staying on as Flying Rock, out wide as Windsor Pass, then Crystal Dawn. Q Palace, Sweet Justice, Rita Levy, Joe March, take my hand, Maha Seal, but skipping clear is Red Heel inside the final furlong from De Dillon. Q Palace, Crystal Dawn, and they're followed then by Flying Rock, but it's Red Heel and Lee Roach who will see it out by a comfortable couple of lengths. And second is De Dillon, then Q Palace, Crystal Dawn. Curraheen Princess gives chase, then Railteen Fantasy, Wait a Little, Hot Bell, and I've Got Wings, Enya Va, Diamonds for Alice, and Magyar. Racing to the final furlong, and it's Provocatus in front. Followed by Curraheen Princess, staying on as Wait a Little on the outside of Railteen Fantasy. Inside the final hundred yards, it's Provocatus from Wait a Little as they go towards the line. Provocatus is deserving of this, has made all beating Wait a Little, and in third place, Railteen fantasy. 
Curraheen Princess gives chase, then Realty and Fantasy, Wait a Little, Hot Bell, and I've Got Wings, Enya Va, Diamonds for Alice, and Magyar, racing to the final furlong, and it's Provocatus in front, followed by Curraheen Princess, staying on as Wait a Little on the outside of Realty and Fantasy. Inside the final 100 yards, it's Provocatus from Wait a Little as they go towards the line. Provocatus is deserving of this, has made all beating Wait a Little, and in third place, Realty fantasy. is the head past the halfway stage. No speed limit joins issue with on the rail Drish Hero, then Teddy Boy, Stanhope, Pillar, Amazing Emma, Absolute One, Right and Blast of Magic and Guiding Star and Papal B, Bush Truck or Trial, and on tick, it's no speed limit and Drish Hero having a good ding-dong battle inside the final 150 yards, then Amazing Emma, it's no speed limit and Drish Hero, they're going to the line head to head, but it's Drish Hero possibly back up on the inside of no speed limit limit an amazing M in third is the head past the halfway stage. No speed limit joins issue with on the rail Drish Hero, then Teddy Boy, Stanhope, Pillar, Amazing Emma, Absolute One, Right and Blast of Magic and Guiding Star and Papal B, Bush Truck or Trial, and on tick, it's no speed limit and Drish Hero having a good ding-dong battle inside the final 150 yards, then Amazing Emma, it's no speed limit and Drish Hero, they're going to the line head to head, but it's Drish Hero possibly back up on the inside of no speed limit limit an amazing M in third. And then Lady Barrington racing on to the final. Furlong, Fallen Forest, couple of lengths clear from Varna Go, Lucis Naturea, no trouble. King Slayer running on as Lady Barrington. And then Get Go and Strip Light and Lucky Shot inside the final 200 yards. And it is Fallen Forest and Siobhan Rutledge as they go towards the line. All the way here in the first division of the Prism Financial Partners RD Handicap, Fallen Forest. One from Varna Gold and no trouble. And then Lady Barrington racing on to the final. Furlong, Fallen Forest, couple of lengths clear from Varna Go, Lucis Naturea, no trouble. King Slayer running on as Lady Barrington. And then Get Go and Strip Light and Lucky Shot inside the final 200 yards. And it is Fallen Forest and Siobhan Rutledge as they go towards the line. All the way here in the first division of the Prism Financial Partners RD Handicap, Fallen Forest. One from Varna Gold and no trouble. Racing to the final furling and a half, and Pretty Little Lar has come to claim both Fast Kelt and in the black and white jacket, his military star, Loudest Whisper, has set off in pursuit of Pretty Little Lar. Inside the final 150 yards, it's Pretty Little Lar and Robert Weirty in front from Loudest Whisper and Joey Sheridan. A momentous win here for Robert Weirty on Pretty Little Lar, as this winner makes most of home advantage for the Duns, beating Loudest Whisper three way for the third. Racing to the final furling and a half, and Pretty Little Lar has come to claim both Fast Kelt and in the black and white jacket. His military star, Loudest Whisper, has set off in pursuit of Pretty Little Lar. Inside the final 150 yards, it's Pretty Little Lar and Robert Weirty in front from Loudest Whisper and Joey Sheridan. A momentous win here for Robert Weirty on Pretty Little Lar, as this winner makes most of home advantage for the Duns, beating Loudest Whisper three way for the third.